Welcome back everyone, Kremlin Archer here. Time for some more Project Zomboid. So we have some zombies down here that are in our space, so I feel like they should get get got. Um, so we have now have a lighter, which is all we need to start my little fire project that I wanted to do. Muldrow map, I don't care about that. Annotated one of those. So I think what the plan is going to be is going to be for this particular in-game day, we're going to get prepared, basically. And then, let's put a, the sheet we got on this one window that we missed earlier. Where are you, sheet? There you are. Yeah, we're gonna get it prepared for, for, for fire time, and then tomorrow will be fire time. Because the thing about fire time is going to be that we're going to have to spend, like, the better part of a day, if not an entire day, running circles around burning zombies to keep them all in one space so they don't wander off and start lighting fires everywhere. At least that's the goal. We'll see. It might not, might not work out the way I want it to. So lighter flower can go in here too. Put the soap in our main inventory because I'm sure our clothes are dirty. Actually, it just looks like our plant pants. Still pristine kicks. Also, we have now have a stretch screwdriver of immensity. Whatever that means. <laughs> so we need, what we need is we need our, we need our campfire kit and we need some stuff to fuel it with. Which I was looking for the book we finished. Where did I, did I drop it over here? There. Yeah, so we're going to get, we're going to take this book, unusable wood, which I hope can be used as firewood. Um, depends on if they updated their updated their information about this kind of stuff when they um, when they put that into the game. I'm going to try to get into a place to where we can set up this fire here. Probably out in this field would be a good choice. Maybe the other one because it's closer, but I think this will be alright. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. There you go. Unusable wood. Okay, good. So we'll put the other stuff into the fire here tomorrow. If I throw this stuff on the ground next to it, can I use it for this same thing or am I might have to hold it? My Unusable wood. All right, so we can leave some of this stuff behind here. All right, so the plan will be: we will we'll come over here in the morning. We will light this fire on fire. We will then go and fetch as many zombies as I can find, and bring them back here and light them on fire. At which point, we will do circles around them to keep them from wandering off until they burn out. Hopefully it works. Uh. 
That timing was close, I almost got bit there. A little tighter than it needed to be. Alright, so I'm gonna break, I think I'm gonna break down a few more things in here to add to our potential, um, potential wood supply, which I think needs a, means I need to get out a hammer. Oh, I need a saw. Which is in my bags already. I am so smart. does give like very very minor cooking like carpentry points not much but a little bit also we have some things here oh we got actual planks out of that well in that case let's barricade the house up a little bit Expecting to get unusable wood. You know what we should barricade is that one window that they broke on the back of the house. It's probably top priority. There we go. Bump, 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 bump. And done. More actual planks. More oh, an actual plank. Hopefully the stuff we found will be good enough. Can I forge back here anywhere? If I walk out into the woods here a little bit. Forge is back over there. All right. Um, mostly just want materials. I think I didn't reselect that like I was supposed to. Find anything? Nope. Chipstone. Last time I wanted a chipstone, I couldn't find it anywhere. There's a tree branch, that's what I want. That's the kind of thing I was looking for. Fuel for the fire! Hey, you, where do you think you're going? Oh, they broke another one of my windows. Pretty good timing on that break. Well, now we need to dismantle something and put a barricade over there. Oh, hello. Excuse me, guys. Just a second. Oh, 
Oh, we got a plank right here. That'll do. Knee nails. There you go. Skill point. Ooh, sprinting. I love higher levels of sprinting. Makes life so much easier. Alright, let's eat something. You know what I'm gonna eat? We're gonna make this make this salmon before it starts to go bad. It's not gonna last much longer. It always takes way longer to cook than I think it should. Hey, you got up super early. I'm not surprised you're sleepy. I haven't gained like any weight. In fact, I think I may have lost some since we started this game. <laughs> so glad I took that underweight trait. <laughs> Didn't account for insane zombies when I took the underweight trait. Yeah, let's just read our book here. I feel like it's probably a bad sign that I can hear those, hear the, um, hear the, uh, Bugs? This probably means it's too close. Actually, I think we might go sleep in the... Isn't there a bed in another room over here? Yeah, we're gonna sleep in here. I don't know. That's what I was afraid of. Is that it? Anybody else responding to that gunshot? Looks like we're okay. Grab this guy. Why is there still the buzz buzzing sound over here? zombies. Alright. Keep him reading until like 2130 maybe. It's fire time. All right, he's no. I should probably let him read some more. I don't want him getting up too early. Stick twenty one thirty. So you know what? We'll just read until he's done with this book, since he's only twenty pages away. There you go. Nope. Don't walk to sleep. Sounds like we got some zombies. So 
somewhere. Oh, right here. Hello. Oh, there's more of them than I thought. Couldn't you guys have shown up later when I had the fire ready? Be nice if we could get a a level up on the bat. I have no idea what criteria it uses to decide. Nope, not gonna do that, okay. Oh, there's some behind us too. Grip! Where are all you coming from? I don't have anything good to use to fight these guys with. Oh, why didn't that kill you? Why is that not killing her? That making me very sad and slightly confused. I'm not carrying any wet, any food, unfortunately, because I kind of wanted to just I was gonna just go and start the uh, fire situation here. Okay, good. Killed that guy. Make sure these guys are all still angry at me. We're gonna start the fire a little earlier than I meant to. There it is. Alright, you know what you're actually I think we're gonna just do here is do a and a proof of concept. I'm just gonna stick with this smaller group of zombies. Not gonna grab a big big bunch. Just so we can prove that this is gonna work the way I want it to. Alright, they're essentially all on fire now. I don't have any beta blockers, unfortunately, which is what I was hoping for. I think I think I remember hearing that if you can keep them like in the in actual fires, it speeds up the the speed at which they burn. But I could be wrong about that. But so this is the this is the basic premise of what I was thinking. Get them on fire. And you just circle and wait, basically. There's one of them just died. All 
I think I heard another one go down. It's one in the back that's getting real slow, too. Another one went down. There's, there's another one. I expect most of them are going to fall here pretty soon. Somebody else just went down. Yep, here they go. It's actually a was a decent thing that because of where we put it, the 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 wood, or the dirt, is kind of a pretty natural fire break. Cool. Alright, we killed them all. Now just wait here a second to make sure all the fires go out. Just the, that's the plan. That's the basic idea. Which I guess we'll do with a larger group of zombies next time. Because that's how long it took to do this group. So I'm gonna, I'll wrap things up here, uh, and I'll, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks so much.